Hi everyone, my name is Linda. Welcome to my channel called Linda Savings. We are starting a new month with great deals at your favorite Costco store. I found a lot of amazing new products this week, including a new salad spinner, new snack items from the Siete brand, which of course is known for its very clean ingredients, Birria Beef Ramen, the 7 Sunday Cereal, and much more. Now remember that these new arrivals may vary depending on your store location. Once again, remember that these new arrivals may vary depending on your store or location. And also, I want to hear from you. At which Costco location do you do your shopping? Let me know in the comments and please don't forget to like and subscribe and let's do this. And don't forget to take advantage of these offers. With Rakuten, you can get an additional $30 when you sign up and spend $30 or more using the referral link that is in the video description. You can also receive up to 20% cash back every time you shop at your favorite stores. Alright guys, so let's start off today's video with the salad spinner that I just found brand new here at Costco. This one is from the brand Farberware. It's currently selling at the price of $17.99. There you have the measurements for the basket and for the bowl. And one, one nice thing actually about it is that it really does have a non-slip base. have a couple of family members that have this item and it seems like it's a staple in every home. So once again, it's a salad spinner. You can put in here things like um, any kind of veggies, anything that you're going to make a salad with, or even some berries in here if you want to make sure they dry a little quicker, right? Here are some additional details. It does have a soft touch pump, which you can push down to easily dry the leafy greens, your berries, or anything else of that sort, right? $17.99, one really great item. And over here on the frozen food section, I found this brand new item from the Real Foods brand. I really like most of their products. This one is a churro cheesecake. I'm not sure why it says tamale on there, but it's called a churro tamale too, apparently. So for 12 of them, the asking price is $12.99. So it's pretty much like a churro with a cream cheese filling from what I'm reading. For one tamale, it is 300 calories, pretty calorie dense if you ask me. 19 grams of fat, 31 grams of carbs, 15 grams of sugar. 4 grams of protein, and there you have the ingredients for both the masa and the filling. I also found this new item from the True Fruit brand, one of those brands that we've seen here plenty of times at Costco before, and this time it's raspberries with white and dark chocolate. These are selling at $10.99. Seems like it's a very calorie friendly treat. A 20 ounce bag, let's see here the nutrition facts. So for one ounce or four to five pieces, it is around 90 calories. 5 grams of fat, 10 grams of carbs, 8 grams of sugar, and then 1 gram of protein. Down here you also have the ingredients. But you know, I did try their white chocolate with the pineapple. I tried the strawberries and cream one, which I think that wasn't as calorie friendly. Um, but this one's one of those that's only 90 calories for every serving, and it's raspberries with chocolate. I feel like that's a really good combination. Okay guys, and I already know that every time I see ramen or a cup of noodles, it's very high in sodium, but I couldn't help to be excited for this one. This is birria and beef ramen with vegetables. $14.99 for this 40 ounce bag. And yes, my heart was jumping in joy to be honest. Calories, 260 calories for every half a packet. So 11 grams of fat. There's a very high sodium that I previously mentioned. 30 grams of carbs and 11 grams of protein. Down here you also have the ingredients, but has anyone tried this one? I'm really curious. I really cannot wait to grab a sample of it. And hopefully I manage to do that very soon. I've seen these keto ice cream bars before here at Costco, but I think it's my first time seeing this butter pecan flavor, and it sounds pretty good. $12.99 for this one. You do get 12 bars in this one box. Totals up to around 3 ounces or so. Now let's see here some of the nutrition facts. I'm very curious to know about the um, sugar here. So let's see, for total sugars, it does say 1 gram, 3 grams of fiber, 12 grams of carbs, 3 grams of protein, and 18 grams of fat. So of course, it's keto, higher in fats, and that's are those, those are the calories, I'm sorry, for every one bar, or every one ice cream bar, right? There you have the ingredients, but this one claims to be gluten-free, and there's no added sugar.
Today I also found the 7 Sunday cereal. This one is green free apparently and it's also keto friendly. So a lot of people really like this cereal because of how clean the ingredients are pretty much. So let's check out the price here. It's currently selling at $11.49 and that's the price you're paying for a 20 ounce bag. If you compare that to Target, I mean this is really an, an unbeatable price even with no discounts applied, right? So here are the ingredients. It has almonds, coconut, sunflower seeds, dates, pecan pumpkin seeds, coconut oil, flax seeds, chia seeds, strawberries, bananas, and vanilla extract. Sounds really clean to me. 170 calories for every 30 grams, 15 grams of fat, 9 grams of carbs, around 5 grams of protein. Has a little bit of fiber in there, but I've never personally tried it. But if you like it and if you recommend it, definitely let me know. This one is a strawberry banana nut flavor. Now it's been a while since I've seen these grain-free cookies. These are Mexican wedding. They're really good actually. These are made with almond flour and coconut oil. I've tried them a couple times. I thoroughly enjoy these cookies. They're pretty good. 16 ounce bag at the price of $9.49. That is a really good price by the way. Here are the nutrition facts. 150 calories for every about 5 cookies around uh, 30 grams. 9 grams of fat, 17 carbs, 8 grams of sugar, and then 1 gram of protein. And then again, here we have the ingredients. But like I said, guys, I thoroughly enjoy these. I don't feel like they're very um, extremely sweet. Um, I think they're very well balanced. These are vegan and also gluten-free. Here's another item that is from the Siete brand. Now, if you know their chips, they're usually made with avocado oil. Now, these are also dairy-free, and these are called Fuego, which I'm so excited about because I love spicy chips, and, but I'm not quite sure how spicy these are. These are gluten-free, apparently, and now these are also selling at the price of $5.99, and that's the price you're paying for a 12-ounce bag. So that's a very good size and a really great price. Here are the nutrition facts for about 19 chips. It is, it is around 130 calories, 7 grams of fat, 20 carbs, 125 in sodium, 3 grams of fiber, 1 gram of protein in there. And then right here you also have the ingredients and as you've seen some of their previous items or when it comes to their chips especially, most of them, the first ingredient on there is cassava blend. So has anyone tried these? I love spicy chips like I previously mentioned. So I'm wondering how spicy are they? Let me know in the comment section down below. And for all my pistachio lovers, check out this combination right here. It's dark chocolate with pistachios with sea salt. That sounds really good. This is from the Sconza brand. And let's see here for the bag, the asking price here at Costco is of $12.99. That's the price you're paying for a 24 ounce bag once again. Now let's check out here the nutrition facts. Let's see here, 17 pieces, which totals to around 30 grams or so, which is a serving size. It is around 160 calories, 11 grams of fat, 14 carbs, three grams of fiber, does have 10 grams of sugar, and then three grams of protein. And then down here, you also have the ingredients. But this looks like a really good combination. I'm excited to try this one next. And I feel like it's not often when we bump into macaroni that is made of red and white quinoa. So this one is gluten-free, it's vegan, it's plant-based, it is organic, and it's also from the brand Go Go Quinoa. So this one's currently selling at $7.99. And once again, it is pasta, so I'm sure you can mix it with some of the incredible sauces that you can find here at Costco. Add some protein to it, like some ground beef or some ground turkey or even ground chicken, and you have one complete meal. Once again, it is organic, it's also corn-free, and here are the nutrition facts. 210 calories for every half a cup, one gram of fat, 45 grams of carbs, and five grams of protein. And I would say that cashews is probably one of my favorite nuts. So I found this combination right here. It's Baja Taco Cashews. It's cashew seasoned with jalapeno, sour cream, lime, garlic, and tomato. It is a 22 ounce bag. Now let's see here the price. It's currently selling at $8.99. It is from the brand Nature's Garden. Now, of course, naturally, I want to see the nutrition facts here. So let's go ahead and dive right into that. So for one fourth of a cup, it is around 170 calories, 14 grams of fat. Of course, they're nuts, so they're higher in fats, nine grams of carbs, one gram of fiber and five grams of protein.
And has anyone spotted these Lucky Brand tees in their local Costco? Seems like this is a three pack. So it comes in super cute colors. You get this really nice pastel purple, a pink, and then the last one is not white, guys. It's actually like more like a mint green color. It's just super cute as well. They're all tag free and they run from sizes small, medium, large, or extra large. And so for the three pack, the ice cream price is at $14.99. Has anyone purchased these? I'm wondering if they're see through or like they're actually okay and so let me know definitely because these are so tempting they also have this really nice color combination you can choose from which is the white the gray and the black here's some more information regarding these tees and then once again here are the sizing um, measurements so if you were a dress size let's say four to six you would be a small etc these look super cute let me know if it's tempting for you as well And that is all the updates that I have for today. Remember to turn on your notification button to know when I have uploaded a new video. See you guys next time.